Hello everybody. So I haven't had the time to play nine parchments in the past few days, but here we are again and we are gonna try to push as far as we can in this video. This is part six and yeah, enjoy it. So two days ago I wanted to record some uh, some gameplay of nine parchments, but unfortunately I was really tired and I just figured to cancel it. Uh, the part that you missed is me getting and picking up a new spell, which is this one. It's uh, a life orientated, uh, it's a thunder orientated skill, excuse me. And it's basically a burst of skill, you spam it, and it will, after it hits the first target, well, if it hits, it will jump on to the next one. Uh, as I said, I was tired and I didn't have much time to test it out, but I went for it because the other two were, I, I believe it was a fire spell or an ice one, and I'm definitely sure it was a, a dead spell, which when I read it thoroughly, it damaged my, myself if I don't execute the casting or I don't know, something like that, so I didn't want to damage myself when I mess up and I do mess up and you witnessed it so this is the take two of part six and I hope I don't mess it up because I'm feeling good I'm feeling Maybe great. Maybe I'm too old for this wizarding business. Spell casting requires so much skill, steadiness of hand and memorization. Not to mention all the chaos and exceptional safety regulations. Now that I come to think of it, it reminds me a lot of baking. right into it. Okay, so the dog thingies die a, a lot faster than the flowers. I should be focusing on them. And the flowers should be my last target. Because they they have a lot of HP and their spell casts are not that aggressive so I can evade them. Any parchments here? Nothing. I didn't get the time to check this area out. Anything here? Any hidden chests? Nothing hidden. I have to be careful, this area is precarious and I could fell down into the water and I and every time I do that I will die. So I don't wanna use my last chance like that. And again. Yeah, this new spell is really nice. Good. And there was a parchment I already collected, but I'm gonna show it. Show the per collection process. Because why the hell not? So, this is an awkward part. If you go up on this thingy, it will lift. And if you manage to hop down, you will die. So don't do that. I broke in the game last time I did it. A rather unorthodox method of travel. And I wasn't this high up. I was like uh, one meter above the ground. And you just die because it's like those bridges when they fall down it's uh, a point of no return so this works like that it lifts and if you stay down you're dead so take care okay flowers let's beam them up like this yeah it's an epic spell okay two down i went for the flowers this time because they were really close to me and the healers were there, and this guy uh, sounds like trouble. So I didn't want to fight him there with the flowers chasing me. Okay, let's heal up. 
Okay, I thought I missed. This will take ages, so let's switch to a more damaging spell. Okay, let's heal up since we used it. Okay, I failed to avoid that. And so it's one on one. Let's see if I remember how to fight it. No, I don't. No, I don't. Okay, good. He's immune to that. Be careful. And he's dead. Good. Definitely better than the last time. Any parchments, chests? I'm so afraid to go here. Okay, I won't die. Whenever I see water, I'm like, just, I don't want to go there. It's really, like, I have a feeling it's baiting me to my death. And I don't want to go. So look at this. There's a parchment here. If it weren't, I would never go here because it looks like death. Anything under the bridge? Can I go under it? No. Up here. This this looks nice. It gives off like a China vibe or a Japan vibe. Yeah, more Japan vibe. They have those kind of trees in Japan. Maybe in China too, I don't know. But I definitely see movies. With those things. Okay, let's take him out. Let's use those. And these. And the bouncy things. Oh man, they are so epic. They rinse down targets. That was fast. Yeah, the game manages to amaze me every time with these spells. They are so unique. Really loving that aspect. Whoever came up with those spells, great job. Great job indeed. Okay, a little bit of chaotic out here. Where are the healers? Yeah, take it. Okay. Okay, let's take him out. Okay, one healer left. I don't know if he's a healer, but he should. Reminds me of one. Okay, I missed a little bit. Out. Ooh, nice crits. Nice. And again. I can feel that crit rate coming in right now. Nothing there. Here, can I jump? No. In a parchment I already collected. Anything here? Just death if I go there. So Hopping down is the way to go. Let's just check out if we can find some chests here. Hidden in the canopy of these beautiful trees. Okay, big open area. If you know what it's coming, what is coming. Okay, return. Here, when the difficulty of a journey is at its hardest, and you will receive a new challenge. So, <laughs> I don't think I will play this game on the hardest. It's quite challenging on the hard mode. Okay, here's a chest. Good. It's really challenging. I wouldn't like it if it were a bit harder than this, to be honest. Ouchie. Okay. okay, movement speed saving me there. Let's keep it behind and go. Good. Okay, one down. Or one left. One left. Yeah, this is the way to go with them. And we leveled up. 
Good. Uh, crit. Crit hit chance, yeah. That's what we were working on the last time. Let's keep going. Let's slay us some enemies. I did this thing, it looks like those. Yeah, I can jump up. And it's really nice because the enemies are swarming you, and if you can find a good timing for it, you can actually be safe up there. And I'm gonna try it right now just for the sake of it. Okay. okay. Save me! No. Okay, which one will go up next? Oh. Okay, so. Um, I cannot figure them out. And then. And then. Ah, oh, I was late. No, 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 no. Okay. Time to stop messing around. Take some enemies out. Take me! Take me! No! I will die! Yeah, it's much easier just to stand on them, but you'll get wrecked if you do that. Anything here? Under the waterfall? Nothing. Okay, here was another parchment. Okay, a wide open area with a save point. And my arch nemesis. Oh yeah, these spells are perfect for those suiciders. One down. Anything that magic, okay. Pay attention. Okay, this area went okay. That sounded weird. Oh, 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 this looks like a party. I'm not even going to pay attention on the news. There are too many of them. Let's try to damage something. It's a fist fight or a broom fight. Anything here? Nothing. Let's keep moving. Okay, took a few of them down. It's not good. I really need a better point to fight on. Okay, good feeling. Good. My feeling is off. Okay, there's a part in there, let's collect it. And done. That was a lot of enemies on those last two fights. Suddenly, one of the ambitious wizards found a new hat. A new hat, which I already own. And this is the end of the upper level. And that area looks like I could go there. And this area too. But I'm not gonna risk dying. So yeah, let's finish it off. So in 
this part we have two parchments we have to find. The steep and narrow paths meandering up and down through the valleys led the students onwards closer than the parchments. It was time to descend into a rather flooded little valley. I really need to get used to those guys and that type of fighting. So movement speed won't help me there. I have to jump over it. Or run away from it if I have the space. But if it's an arrow area, there is no chance to escape it. In a blaze of glory. Pay attention. Come on. came out from here and I think okay we have an elevator mechanism here and a parchment I had not collected There 
isn't a lot of space to maneuver around him here. And as the last fights went on, I noticed that if I move further out to the stage, more enemies will swarm me and I don't want to fight too many of them at once. Yeah, there is a parchment port on pride. Yeah, imagine if I went there. And this is a problem because I cannot access my region well. I can now. So that's a ten days. So worth it taking that damage to shot shoot them down. I took the damage because I wanted to collect the, the mana region. I I reckon it's mana region, the blue blue clovers. Well, let's pick some stuff. Oh, we can't pick. No. Yeah and that happened. No more Only breaking one stuff. Chop. It's up to me to fix this. Oh. Ouch. Yeah. I died in a blaze of glory. <laughs> that was really bad. Uh, that first death was so unnecessary, but we, we we're gonna get a good checkpoint, so... That was fortunate. What happened there? Oh, that was a weird mechan was a weird mechanism. So basically, it slowed down my stun, and while it was in the process of slowing down, it stunned myself. Is it slowing these? No, it's not. It's just deflecting them. So I'm gonna board behind and just find everybody. Oh, not gonna work. Let's do it again. Because they are situated really nicely on the bridge. Mm, fire? Good. And a chest here. In the big tree. I should be focusing on finding those apartments. Oh, ooh, this is a big area. Oh, he nearly one shot at me there. Wow. That's a lot of enemies. Let's just evade them all and hopefully they will kill each other. Yeah, just like that. Yeah. Kill your buddies. Kill your buddies and make the job easier for me. Yeah, nice. Tingling, and they should be. Come on, I Ooh. Okay, and a level. Let's finish off our crit hit chance. I will call it crit rate from now because it's basically a crit rate increase and so we have critical hit damage which is epic dealing fire damage has 20 I, I read over already this one we're gonna go for the crit hit damage because we already leveled the crit rate so it's natural it's uh, the natural flow of the game when you get enough crit rate you're gonna go for crit damage and there is the parchment hidden 5 from 5 
the completionist in me is yelling yay <laughs> let's go uh, and now it's just me versus the game Bouncy thingies, bouncy thingies, where are you? Where are you now that I need you? I'm not gonna sing anymore, sorry about that. <laughs> Any chests? I'm so proud of myself for collecting all five parchments this far in, in the game. Nice. Ice immunity. One more ice immunity. Oh, that's an ice aura. Okay. You can't heal that man. The crit damage is too much. It's too much. It's over 9,000. <laughs> Ice immunity, don't forget it. Boom. You are not immune to that, bro. So, this was the fifth parchment in this part. And I reckon we are near the end. Ooh. They look small but mean, and yeah, they are. Only one chance. It's up to me to fix this. Wow. That did a lot of damage. Whoa, 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 whoa. Hold on, cowboy. I don't know which one did more damage. Couldn't really pay attention. Was his aura damaging me that much? Or were those the, the little yellow thingies? Because something rinse me down really fast I don't like them I don't like them get away from me they're self-destructing oh 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 that was luck that was pure luck and I remember them they were in the the boss fight I I reckon it, it was the third boss fight with the bird which had the arrows yeah, they gave me a hard time at the end. I oh, here is the fifth part, so that one was the fourth. And this is the end of the level. Perfect. So three deaths, two were self-inflicted. Sorry about that. And we missed a chest. Sorry about that, too. Oh, we have one more level before the boss fight. Sorry. S sorry about that. Can we go here? Uh, that looks toxic. And that looks inviting, but I won't risk it. The air in the warm valleys was humid, for there were numerous hot spring pools in the region. This is a really bad position to be fighting in because this snake is gonna give me problems and I have to heal up quickly. So, kill the bird first. Easy, easiest to kill. Then get behind them. Yeah, nice. I really need to slow down when they spawn and just pay attention. So, left or right? Left or right? Well, up and down. Let's go down and see if there's anything here. Oh, where are you leading me to? Oh, sorry, got lost. Yeah, 
to the beginning. Sorry about that. I won't make the same mistake again. I feel really dumb. I feel really dumb right now. Rookie mistake. Rookie mistake. Yeah. I will probably die here if I go, so I won't risk it. The bubbles are showing me that the pool is probably hot and maybe toxic. Okay, one down. They are shielded. Ooh. Wow, that's a lot of damage. It's getting... Ooh. Getting harder. Progressively harder. Yeah, I have to take some damage. And I'm all out of region, and my arch nemesis is jumping around like a maniac. Good. Yeah, it's getting harder. That, that was 144 damage per hit. And I reckon I have like 700, 800 damage. Uh, health, pardon me. Okay, so this is the way we should go. Anything here? This looks like a chest, but we had one here, so I reckon it won't be a chest. Going really fast in this part. Should pay more attention. Okay, a parchment. And there's a parchment. I hope I didn't miss it. So remember, a parchment is on the stairs. Okay. Let's take it out of the game really quickly. This won't do much damage. Will this damage then? Oh, it will. Oof. That was a nice down lock from him. Good. Now we are getting closer to that parchment on the stairs. Hop down. Something is gonna come out from that cave, 100%. So let's bomb the cave as soon as we. It will? It won't. From this one. Okay. And from that one too. And this is a lot of enemies. Oof. Okay. We survived. And they are helping me out, which is nice. But now it's time to help them out. Whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. Can I make it? Yes, I can. Round two, bitches. Good. I was too close for comfort. But that's what is really immersive at, uh, in this game. It really plays good and it's fun. Scaling down the cliffside would require some care. Yeah, I can scale cliffs, but I suicide in a little pond. A really pond. fight. I'm getting a bit scared. Not scared, just uh, uh, surprised. Yeah, that's their, their perfect word for these fights. With these creep spawns. For example, I'm out of ideas here. I'm just baiting them so I can, I don't know, m maneuver around them like this. Yeah, I have to pay attention. And I did a double hit, they were standing really close. So, so maybe I can hit these two. Yeah, nice. 
so melee for the shielded ones works perfectly. Don't bother wasting time with the, the spell casts and wasting teleportations behind them. Because that can bite you in the ass. Okay, a chest. I'll take that. Shocking one. That wasn't good. I poured it right into his stun and I guess it got cancelled. Good thing I missed. I reckon it was really bad. It deflected that and just killed me. Good, good. Some luck on my side. I can't remember. I'm all out of last chances in this game. I don't remember I died. But well, I hope I don't find out. It's never good to die. In games or in life. <laughs> Especially in life. are doing that Kamehameha babe thingy again. Well that was Rasenko from Go Gohan. Yellow beams. Okay, so critical hit damage. Yeah, Gohan had the yellow beams with his Rasenko which he used against Vegeta on the planet Namek. And they were collecting the Namekian Dragon Balls. Okay, immunity. Get out. Okay, this is not fun. Fire and lightning immunities. Let's take it slow with the ice spells. Pull it out. And nothing else left to do. There's too many of them, and if I let's try to bomb them, maybe some of them aren't immune to fire. Thank you. I will take that here. And you are not in here. You shocked anymore, my friend. And you will die. And now you will die. And now you will die. Please. Kill your buddy. I don't have a problem with that. And so, now the slow paced fight continues. Ooh. Don't do me like that. Are they in? Yes, they are. Oh. 
die already. Yes. Any chest parchments? This was a long fight, and I didn't have time to check things out. Okay, a bridge. Anything here? Except my death. Like first time I played this game, my worst enemy were the the red element jumping animals. I will call them that. The rank the red thingies. They just jump jump every time and I didn't have answer for them. And in this run I'm just killing myself by falling down and just suiciding. It always has has to go wrong somewhere. Okay, one down. That's a fire in me. Ah, oh, this works perfectly. And this won't work. Yeah, nice. And five out of five. We are getting somewhere, guys. That's the second stage in a row, we are 5 out of 5. Oh, no. No, I didn't do that. Mistakes were made, mistakes were made. Time for some damage control. Oh man, that was awful. Oh no. Only one chance. I it's just up to me couldn't to fix this. recover from that. It's too much stuff flying at me. Stop it. Ugh, so nasty. What the? What? Like my senses are exploding at the moment. Don't fall in the water. <laughs> don't get hit. Jump. Up, jump, I don't know, I'm doing a billion things at the moment. Don't pour it in the water, don't get killed by your own spells. Um, uh, good, give me that chest. Thank you. Okay, so we used our last chance. This is the way to go, I reckon. Let's check this part out. What? Why did you spawn? Why? Why? What did I do to you? Oh no, oh no, it's a fiesta. It's a fiesta. Ugh. So nasty, so nasty. you with this and you too Whoa. um okay so there are two paths which one to choose am I going backwards again am I yes I am yes I am okay it's getting kind of confusing yeah with these bridges and a lot of things are happening I'm so glad this came to an end before I die one more time yeah it's a celebration 5, five out of 5 parchments and 3 out of 3 chests yeah and it's a boss fight Fishy. I seemed the hot fishy. springs were home to one particularly temperamental inhabitant who would not easily give up the next parchment. Stop it. Okay. I have no idea how to fight him. Okay. Take it. Take it. This is not. This is scaring me. Okay. 
Okay. Let's heal up. So what now? What now? What are you gonna do? What sorcery is this? I'm ready for you. I'm ready. Okay. I did. I wasn't ready for that. Okay, this will cast a circle, which I won't avoid. Okay, I didn't avoid that one either. Pay attention. Stay calm. I wonder if I step into these waters, what will happen? Nothing. Nothing. Absolutely nothing. Okay, so I can't, can't jump over them, so they tactics on. I pr probably these waters will save me if I stand here. Let's yeah, yeah, I have to stand behind these waters and they will extinguish. Yeah, good, good. That was nice. I love when I figure how the boss fight should work fast in game. Okay, so this should be probably the safe area. No. Okay. So I have this one. Yeah, this one touched me, right? Yep. Good. Again. Good. Okay, so we figured him out. Now let's rinse him down. This is a, a line one, and now this one will come after me. Avoid it. Good. And again. Now I can cast spells because I know I'm safe. Yeah, it's fairly easy. We managed to figure him out. There is not a lot of RNG here. So I can execute this fight perfectly from now on just stay here in my safe corner and miss a lot okay and mess up, mess up a lot the deal am I damaging? Damage you can Ooh, ooh, don't kill yourself boy. Do we have a yeah, we need that other region. I didn't pay much attention to his spawns of skills because I want to damage him. He was out of my range. I need more damage! This is so boring! Takes ages! Yeah, I don't wanna go that close to him. But I have to if I wanna damage him. Okay, he is meleeing me. Good thing to know. me out of the stage I had the feeling it will and I I probably got lucky there I don't know if, if it can launch you out of the stage but if the mechanics are similar to the pods we've had on the first few stages which will lift you up then it should be able to pull you off the stage okay a couple more hits I'm not paying attention at the moment, I just want to rinse him down. Bravo! Good. 
Oh. And by the way, he looked like C Dram C Draman from Digimon. If you ever watched Digimon or played the games, I did a, a playthrough of Digimon World 1 and Digimon World 3 on my channel. So if you're interested, you can check it out. But there is no commentary there about it. But it's a really nice gameplay and a fun. And I finished both games. And I had a lot of Ultimate Digimon. So yeah, check it out. And I'm gonna check this chest out. I couldn't have done this without you. So everybody, that was it for this part 6. I hope you enjoyed it. I enjoyed myself a lot. It was fun. And I really got immersed this time in this gameplay. It was really fun. And so, thank you for the support. Thank you to all of my 45 subscribers. I know it's not a lot, but it means a world to me. So yeah. I will keep dishing these videos out and if you like it thumbs up and see you next time.